ไปโฮมายโน No, you did not. That was so. How are you doing, me and Garrett? You know him as GM Golf. We just made it to Walmart to pick up the supplies for today's 10 cup challenge. We watched the video. I believe we need, we need a rake. We need a rake. We need a wooden baseball bat. We need a wooden. We need a shovel. We need a shovel. And we need the gardening tool. A hoe. The gardening tool. Conveniently, everything we need is in one section. We got the rake. We got the hose. And we got the shovel. Sadly, though, they only have they only have like big shovels, not the same size ones they had in the movie that Kevin Costner used. So it's gonna be tougher to swing, but we'll see. So true story, I've actually hit a rake out of a bunker onto the green to three feet. So I think so. This is a strategy here, Bobby. There we go. You gotta get low and down. Here's the philosophy: can barely talk through the mask. See how it's more rounded? Okay. We got more of that leading edge. That's more forgiving. Perfect. All right, so quick little problem here. They do not carry any wooden bats at Walmart. Let's grab the 30 incher. Give us, give us a little more. Give us a little more leverage using a 30 inch bat instead of the 28. I love it. And uh, yeah, now we're gonna go check out. And uh, yeah, we'll see you at the course. Yeah, you. Hey, listen. <laughs> Bubby's spending 82 bucks and 59 cents in this video, so you guys better hit that subscribe button and view it so he can make that money back. Thank you. All right, guys, we got everything we need here. We got the shovel, we got the rake, we got the gardening tool, the hoe, <laughs> we got the baseball bat, and we got golf balls, of course. You can't play golf without golf balls. And uh, yeah, we'll catch you at the course. And we are gonna do a two-man scramble here, and we are going to play three holes. Par four, par three, and a par five. Let's get to it. Garrett's gonna start us off here. Oh, I was gonna oh. do it. Diving in the action, okay, I used to play baseball, so that didn't work. <laughs> oh, grounder. I haven't swung a baseball bat in a while, so I'm happy with it, you know? All right, here we go, guys. I think, obviously, the play off the tee is going to be the baseball bat. Most distance, most yardage. I don't really know what the other stuff's gonna be used for. We'll probably use the hoe out the sand, the shovel will be chip shots, and then we'll use the rake for putting, maybe. I like it. All right. All right, let's, let's see, see what happens. Let's see if we can cut a little bit off this dog leg here. Oh, oh. my. No. No. You realize you just hit that like 250, 250 yards at least. That's up by the green. <laughs> Let's go, guys. So we hit a 250 yard hole here and I'm not, I'm not gonna cap though. The ground is very, very hard. It that is. thing rolled a long ways, but we ended up right here right next to the green with the pin, and it looks like Garrett's gonna go with the shovel. Get the right hand low, the left hand up, and just send it. Oh, it rode up the face a little bit? Okay, I'm not, okay, we're putting. I'm not sure if that's the play though, Bubby. Here you go. I think this is the play. I think you had the right idea. It just rode up the face a little too much. Once, once the ball's in play off the tee, we have to play it from the ground. Yeah. There's no picking it up anymore. Exactly. Okay, you actually hit a pretty good one. All right, let's see if we can do it here, folks. Oh, see, it just rode up the face. That's the scary part about this shot. That rode right up the face. It did. How did Kevin Costner do this? I don't know. I think it's because <laughs> it was a movie and he didn't it, actually it do it. It was a movie, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so coming up to the green, we're obviously going to be taking Garrett's shot. It was worlds better than mine. Yeah, the rake looks good. I like the rake. Rake looks good. You get it locked in the side here, up the forearm, up the left arm, and you just dive. A little, a little Matt Kuchar action. Okay, okay, okay. It went a little right. Kind of came off the face a little right. That's a good putt though, I like that. I like the rake. Um, I just need to make a little solid, more solid contact there and I would have been good. Ooh, he's going with, all right, this is this is called the I'm... window wiper 3000 right here. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Frick, just topped it a little bit. This it's is, not easy. This is not easy. This is tough. Again, we will we will take Garrett's shot. I think that I think the short game so far has been me. The long game is gonna be you today. I'm gonna go first here because I think you're the better I mean no putter with the rake. <laughs> the raker. Right? I'm the better raker actually. Bobby's going up first here. This is for I'm gonna go with your straight. Our birdie, yeah, I like it, I like it. Ooh. He's going over the the right shoulder. Okay, this is a little different here. No. 
No, you did not. That was <laughs> so go. solid. That's that's a strat right there. Dude, that's insane. I want to just try it now. We almost both oh. made it. Okay, that feels like this could be my new putter, guys. I might put that in the bag. Not even kidding. I mean, that's it so feels, pure. It feels good. It's starting to feel a little more realistic that Kevin Costner did this. Yes, I it mean, really is. That's too... Mm, I love it. That... Huh, that, that feels too good. Yeah. Like, oh my goodness. All right, all right, all right. We are walking away with a par there. On that first hole, a surprising par. I wasn't expecting a par. Kevin Costner could be watching. I guess you never know. But yeah, we're on to a par three here. Even par three one. What did you say this is? Like 180 yards? 180 about. Go. Go. Keep going. That's a good ball there though. Good yeah. leave. I mean, we're going to have a chip. We're going to just be short of the green. I kind of played a little bit of a ground ball. Line drive, whatever you want to call it. Oh, bad recording on my part, but it bounced over the weeds. Go, roll. All right. Dude, we're both we're short of the green, just short. I'll take that any day I, of the week. I, I love that sound it makes. I know, it's I beautiful. I love the sound. Here's the situation, walking up to Bubby's ball. Both of our balls are in the fairway, but Bubby's ball has got a nice look at it. And look at what we're using here, guys, the rake. We're gonna go with the putt strategy to try and keep it on the ground and get it more of a consistent roll off the face. Yes, sir. All right, Garrett. Garrett's gonna start us off here. Putting is the strat for sure. Yeah, we're gonna have to hit this hard though. And solid. Here we go. Run, dude! It was right at it. Wow, I that was a chip. Yeah, I kind of got under that a little bit. All right, can Bubby do one better? Let's take a closer listen here. Oh, it's right here, like this. Yeah. Can he do it, folks? Those are, those are those solid. Are, those are respectable shots. Oh, they're so good. Sure. Uh, we have elected to go with my ball. I think it's a little more straight up the hill. Yes, sir. I'll go first again. It worked well last it time. It did work well last time. If here we go. shoot even par in this challenge, yeah. if, if we shoot even par in this challenge, hit that like and subscribe button for your boy. For real. Oh man. It just skipped on Dude. me a little. Right line. Perfect now. line. All right, here's Garrett to save our par on our second hole here. Let's see what he can do. Ah. Take that break. Good roll, though. I mean, just look at it. That's Dude. pure. I'd take this over my putter 10 times out of 10, man. <laughs> All right, walking away with a bogey four there. Neither of us were able to make that putt. Understandable though, putting with a rake from Walmart Garden Center. Now we are on to our third and final hole of this video. We were unable to get on a par five because the course is packed at yeah, sundown for some reason. Dude, this course is always packed, man. I love to see the course packed though. It means the game's growing, people are getting into it. But yeah, finishing hole, one over. Need a birdie here. Need a birdie here. Oh, that was rough. No. Dang it. That was hit hard. Dude, I hit that hard though. Guys, that was a good ball flight. It just went too far right. Oh, oh my. No way. Go. That was about as good as I could hit it. Yeah, I mean, it's going to be in the right rough. We're going to be fine. Let's go, Jeez. guys. Good stuff. That's insane. A good ball oh. ended up right here. Dude. We have 70 yards left of that pin up there. I have no clue what we're going to do though. I think this is how I'm going to get the most power though. I think so too. Oh, it's hot. If, if I hit that back there though. That's a tough shot. It, it's, I went for the good, like I went for it all, you know. It was not the percentage play. Maybe think, you stand up and hit it like a golf club. I think I'm going to have, I'm going to copy your strategy with the bat. And I'm going to try and hit it like this. This is a tough one, guys. Play it off the back foot. Try and swing down on it. Lots of speed. Okay, okay. It's just, it's tough. That's cause, fine though. Cause, Cause the ball is a round object and this is a round object and you have to try and square them up. That's why baseball players, I give y'all props. <laughs> Mad respect for hitting 90 mile per hour fastballs. <laughs> Garrett is electing to use the gardening tool called a hoe. Don't know again how this is gonna work. This is, this feels like the kind of challenge where you just 
slowly gain on it and gain on it until you finally get it in the hole somehow. A little, a little change of clubs here. Oh, old trusty. Tr old trusty. Oh, you. It's long on the green. Are so we're putting. What are you going with? We gotta give this a try in the video. Oh no, you did not. What a shot. Sit. All right, I'll take that, just off the back end. Dude, that's impressive. Obviously, if you do the math, even par is out of play because birdie's out of play on this hole, but we can still make a par here. I, <laughs> you know? You know, you never know what's gonna happen. You never happen. know, man. Crazier things have happened. I know, I've seen crazier things happen in my life. I, uh, Craziest thing in my golfing experience ever happened in your video. All right, a little right to lefter. Wow. Dang, I mean, that's, it was I solid. That, I thought that had to come down that it hill. It went dead straight. Here we go, Bobby. Here we go, man. Sit. Sit. Take that break. No. All right, giving ourselves a look at bogey here man that thing that Dude, thing went went that just ran bro i just hit that shot for fun guys but like dang it, it really does come off well I it tell does you. it's something it's pure here we go garrett to save our bogey it was a tiny bit to the right there bubby man i want to redo this challenge i want revenge you I know too. we we, we can shoot under we can, we definitely can. We have to make this. I feel like if we found the smaller shovel he had in the movie, yeah. it'd be a little easier. We'd shoot on the par with that. Gotta make this to save any sense of respect to keep a double bogey off the scorecard in a scramble. No! Good try. Gave it a good roll. You did. With a double and three over. <laughs> three over through three. Playing with clubs from Walmart Garden Center. That's solid though. That is solid. Think about it though. So when we when we come out here and play these three holes at real clubs, if we're not shooting even par or better, we're doing something wrong. Exactly. But uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, feel free to hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed the content. Feel free to hit that like button if you like it. If you didn't like it, don't hit it. But uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Much love. Peace.